Throughout the dark history of the UK, there has been many serial killers with a liking to a certain way of murder. In Sunderland, Mary Ann Cotton used arsenic as her main weapon to become one of the most infamous serial killers in the UK. Born in Law Moorsley in Horton Le Spring in 1832, she mainly worked as a dressmaker and housekeeper. Her downward spiral is blamed on her inability to cope with her father's death in 1842 when he fell down a mine shaft. Mary was accused of being responsible of the deaths of 11 of her 13 children as well as three of her husbands. All the deaths around her were brushed off as accidents or illness, despite them all having the same symptoms of stomach fever. Despite of all this, Mary was only ever convicted of one murder. One of the main reasons she murdered her husbands was to claim the life insurance policies her spouses had taken out. It is disputed, but her total number of murders is said to be 21. When suspicion came upon her after the death of one of her sons, she was soon arrested and found guilty. She was hanged on the 24th of March, 1873, in Durham. The ship Isis in Sunderland is said to be haunted by her ghost, as she is thought to have murdered two of her children in the tunnels that lead to the pub's basement. Although the tunnels have since been blocked, many have seen the spirit of a young girl dressed in Victorian clothing and have heard cries and screams coming from the victims. It's not haunted by just Mary, but also many of her victims too. She is believed to have rented a room in the pub where she murdered and buried her children. Have you seen any of the ghosts? Let us know down below.